The search for farmer Andrew Dixon's price cow ended here, following a long trek through the Joes River forest in St. Joseph. It comes after he made an offer of $4,000 to anyone who could locate the cow and another $2,000 if they could say who had it. A subsequent tip-off is what led him and the CBC crew he invited along to this densely wooded area. I had a tip this morning about certain things and I took the opportunity to do my own investigation. And when I came here this morning, I saw my cow with the, this big fat chain around its neck and the said rope that I had on it when it was um, by me. So the first thing I did was I went to the cow and I did what you're accustomed to doing when I see her, rub her right on her head and she hold down and take the rub and she was actually happy to see me this morning. The former Barbados Defence Force soldier believes the description of the cow on social media stopped the perpetrator from taking it to the abattoir or moving it any further. He's grateful to those who assisted in his plight. Mr. Dixon says now that he has recovered his animal, his only interest is in having the person responsible for stealing it brought to justice. I want to set an example and I want people to see probably who is the person that stole my cow. I want people to see who bought it. I want the persons to be exposed and I want them to be charged and I don't want the six months and seven months. Whoever moved my cow off the premises, I will let them to go to jail for a long time. Whoever go on people's property to steal the animals in a time like this, I will really let them to go to jail for a long time. That would be the last cow they ever steal. And he has this warning for criminals. Even though we are deep down in this forest and in the bush, there's a place that you can hide where we can't find you or find our stuff. So um, wherever you go after you commit a crime and the police want to find you, they will find you. And you will be found. So if you do crime and you think that there's a part of Barbados you can hide, there's no part of Barbados you can hide. Now that owner and cow have been reunited, Mr. Dixon can once again give his full attention to his farming operation. Rachel Agard, CBC News.